Hi, this is Duke Calloway. We're on a uh, 1981, it's a Mercedes Benz, it's a 300D or a W123 chassis. And a few months ago, my daughter was driving the car and we couldn't get it to start. And everyone was checking the battery and on and on and on. And so we ended up having it towed back home. And um, but then I went online to Ben's World and a few other blogs that kept coming up with all these radical ways of uh, testing, you know, your electrical system. And I figured, you know what, let's just start with the absolute basic. And that is uh, check and make sure that, first of all, that you've got a, uh, a good positive battery that's got the, the 12 plus volts to it. And then from there, what we're going to do is actually check the uh, starter solenoid that's on the car. So we'll take like our handy dandy test light and from here, hook it to the positive terminal on your battery. And then from there, you're going to take the probe and you're going to go down here. And I'm not sure if you can see the starter. And I'm still having trouble figuring out. Okay, there we go. And in here, there's a real small, it's a Phillips head screw that has a, I'm going to say probably a 8 or a 10 gauge wire on it that's running from the ignition switch and the dash that you, has the lock cylinder. And it goes directly to this wire here that's attached to your starter solenoid. Have someone turn the key while you're here, and if you see your test light come on, then you've got a good voltage that's going to the starter solenoid. You don't need to do anything except change the starter itself. Okay? Hopefully that helps you. Thanks for your time.